Looks like Healy's determined to continue. Well, I'm not sure how he can. Bestie's come on. And Healy is still on. They're going to have to lose one of their players. Bestie back pedals out beyond the dead ball line. And Austin Healy is going to play on. Well, you'd certainly imagine that Monster will send something down his channel. Well, here comes Anthony Foley, I think. Stringer, Ronald O'Gara, Rob Henderson. Pass off to Foley, looking for the support inside, Alan Quinlan there. Now, needs to be quick ball, it is. Stringer O'Gara changes the point of attack, Paul O'Connell, Frankie Sheehan. Taken by Martin Johnson, trying to slow the ball up, but it's there. On goes Marcus Horan on a charge all of his own. Hayes there to help, Stringer needs to be now for Munster. O'Gara, he's there! Ronald O'Gara reaches the Leicester line. And Munster have an invaluable try. And he got a bit of afters, I think, going over for that. What a response. Fantastic stuff out of O'Gara. They were always going to attack Austin Healy when he stayed on the field. He should never have been allowed to stay on the field, number one. Frankie Sheehan made the initial burst down his channel. But when it came back, it was good play from the Munster forwards. They took it on. They didn't spread it wide initially. And O'Gara here goes for the dummy inside. And in the momentum, well, he gets there. A great response. Yeah, Martin Curry, the man that he beat. Curry thinking that the pass was going to go outside. And now, uh, maybe a little late from Leicester's point of view, Austin Healy is making way. And O'Gara lines up the conversion. What a response from Munster. It's an important kick. Push it back out to six points again for Munster. He's got it, he's got it. Just has the ability in recent years to land the kicks that count. And the pendulum just swings back the other way in Munster's favor. And Austin Healy really was a terrible tactical decision. 